So here we are on the porch of the Austin State Hospital. It was built in 1857, opened its doors in 1861. I came here today because my great grandmother died of, quote, hardening of the arteries, i.e., Alzheimer's, in 1957. And I'd like to know more about her, but I don't know much about her. I mean, I know a lot about her, I just don't know a lot about her illness. And I came here thinking I might, um, I don't know, have some sort of experience, which I'd say I've had. Big, beautiful pecan trees. I know when my grandfather would have brought his mother here, he would have admired these trees that would have been here, shading this place. I like the haint blue ceiling. Let's look at this real quick. Austin State Hospital, entered in the National Register of Historic Places in 1987. While Texas was a frontier state and psychiatry a pioneer venture, the Texas legislature in 1856 created this hospital for the mentally ill. In 1925, named Austin State Hospital, oldest Texas mental hospital. Construction began in 1857. The institution, then housed in the administration building, was opened May 11, 1861, with about a dozen patients, and has continued to be dedicated to mental health programs. Recorded Texas Historic Landmark 1966. I can just imagine the sadness and the grief of my grandfather taking his mother up these stairs sometime in the mid-1950s with hope that they could care for her, which they did until her passing. And to be here and to, to be here and just to be here is something I've always wanted to do. It's a beautiful building, beautiful grounds. <clears throat> so what I plan on doing is coming here sometime in the fall and getting some graft wood out of these trees, these pecan trees in particular, and grafting them into our pecan trees at home. In her honor, and in the honor of all the people who've worked to try to help people with um, brain illnesses in Texas.